Hello and welcome to episode 78 of my Force of Nature tutorial Let's Play series. This episode will be on making some boots of speed and the gloves of fury and then we can take a look at uh, their usefulness. Um, now I am debating this because the boots of speed will obviously replace my white fur boots which means I won't be getting the warming or the armour value. Um, for the gloves I'll be losing the armour value and the warming. So really I can only use these two in biomes where the temperature is not going to be an issue. Anyway, so let's go have a look at how we make these items. So these items unlock when you get to level 12 and you need to make them at the tailoring table. So let's look at the boots of speed first of all. The recipe is 30 pelts, 2 gold ingots and 100 feathers. So you better start waking that rooster up. And you better start smelting down them gold coins to get you the gold ingots. Anyway that will get you the boots of speed. So let's take them. Uh, next the gloves of fury if we look at that it's 8 fabric, 30 pelts and 2 gold ingots remember you make the fabric at the tailoring table using wool from your sheep so you'll need 2 fabric, to, 2 wool to make each fabric so hopefully you've got a lot of sheep you need another 30 pelts and 2 more gold coins and of course these tools that will then get you the Gloves of Fury, which give you plus 5 damage. The Boots of Speed um, not only actually give you movement plus 20, but I didn't see that before. They give you 15 armour, so that's a nice upgrade over the 6 armour. But like I say, it's not temp there's no temperature protection, so you can only really use these two in areas where you're not going to need this temp the warming basically but let's have a look at uh, how they benefit us so the best way to do that is let's head out and see if we can make more progress to the next shard if we look at the map the next shard is here and you can see I went up here because I started to run in, run in panic um, but let's see if we can build another portal nearer to the next shard. Anyway, so we're going to head to Andromeda. And yes, I'm possibly going to die. But I don't want to sound pessimistic. Just realistic. Okay, so we're heading in this direction. And I had a bit of a detour around this way, I don't know why, but as long as it gets me there. Oh, and even more of a detour. Oh, and I've got a bit of fighting that I'm going to have to do. Although not too difficult. I'll grab the coins. I think this one is tougher. Yeah, level 20. Um, and I better start thinking about what I'm going to eat. Oh, and I think I'm going to die. Yes, I'm definitely going to die. Killed by a goblin. Killed the other one. I think I did. Anyway, let's see. Well, die. Oh, 14 water. That's okay. I got away lightly with that. Right, let's now wear the gloves of fury. And let's put on the boots of speed, because we get a ton more armour from them. Now let's see if that makes a difference. Let's see if I die as quickly. Plus I can get a bit of revenge on them pesky critters. Well, I am moving faster. Just... I'm not sure how discernible it is. Uh, well, it would help if you could see, of course. So let's rectify that. 
always night time whenever I want to go hunting. So if we check the map, am I going the right way? Yeah, so I need to cut across that way. And I think I went up here. Oh, here we go. Yeah, that was only level three, so I'm not going to say that I noticed whether them gloves did anything. I think I've come too far over. I'm sure that was where I was fighting. Maybe not. Oh, here we go. I'm sure this is a path. And I think them creatures have gone. So they killed me and then split. Or is this where I killed them? Oh joy. One of them big golems and a scorpion. Right, do I have the potion of defence or did I use it? I think I'm... A, oh no, there it is. Let's try doing that using that. So, number two. Okay, that's Scorpion Delta. Uh, let's quickly heal up. Eat an apple pie. And try and take out this golem. Yeah, I'm not sure that defence, you know, is... Oh, for goodness sake, how quickly did that kill me? So that's twice dead. Uh, but I got away with it again. All right, apart from the water, but water's easy enough to get. Okay, let's head back. So I'm getting more um, armour from the Boots of Speed. I'm doing more damage from the Gloves of Fury. But the death rate is still consistent. So I'm still going to need to upgrade some more stuff in order to increase my survivability. Because fighting level 20 critters and 21 critters is not good. I can handle one at a time. Gave me a fang. I guess it's better than nothing. Thanks for that. Okay, let's head on, see if we can make a bit more progress. Hopefully without dying. Alright, oh, didn't go that way. Wow, these level 21 creatures are so tough. Two healing potions, can't believe it. At least it gave me some gold coins. Okay, let's eat an apple pie. And let's check the map. So, I need to go this way. I'm going completely wrong direction. So this way. Let's try and see if I can cut my way through these trees. Maybe I won't get so many critters then on me. So let's get me axe. They hit far too hard, so I'm going to get some rocks out. I don't even know if I've got any rocks left. 
Yeah, I've got a few. Let's throw some rocks and finish it off with my mace. So you stand there, Mr. Golem, while I rock you. So I suppose the boots of speed are good for the extra armour and I guess if you like running away from the critters, if you don't panic like I do, then you may live a little longer. Um, the trouble with me is I'm, I panic too much and so I didn't realise to just try and run away from the last critters. I'm not sure if the boots of speed would have let me, allowed me to if I'd have run quick enough. Probably not. Oh, I've got soil that time. Hey, let's have a look. Can I place down... Oh no, I'm still a long way off. Um, but I need to go this way. Oh, must be saving. That's a nice little gap to fit through, so let's put a lamp down there. Oh, I know that. And a lamp over there. Oh, and there's some more of my lamps. So, I would like to go through here. There's some roses. May as well grab them. Can I do an... Oh, nearly I can do a portal. Yeah, this is very dangerous area over here. There's no gaps for me to run into should I get attacked. So, therefore, you are going to need the boots of speed for this. See, like, I've got a scorpion after me. Let's see if I can outrun its venom. Oh, I can get lots of roses. Oh wow, that one goes at the speed of light. Look at that, there's no outrunning that scorpion. That is mega fast. Do you see how quickly that scorpion run? That's insane. Well, I'm going to have to try and go back. Oh, not that I can. Oh, it's far too high level. Quickly get in here before I die. I think I'm poisoned. No, didn't do it in time or it killed me. So there we go, I've died three times. Verdict on the boots of speed and the uh, gloves of fury. Well, they don't really make much of a difference. Unless, of course, you don't panic and you can run. Uh, then hopefully the plus 20 speed will help you. But the armor definitely doesn't seem to have made any difference. I die just as quick. And there we go. Let's try one more time before the timer goes. See if I can make a bit of progress. Three deaths in one episode. Must be a new record for me. Oh, for goodness sake. Oh, nice boy. I'm attacking them with my axe. Is this going to be four deaths? Probably. Yep, four deaths. <laughs> Okay, I think I'm going to end the episode here. Oh, look at that. Saved. 
by the timer and the rooster. Okay, I'm going to end this episode here. I'm not really making any progress to that next shard. Anything I'm doing is getting lots of corpses. Um, but hopefully I will formulate a plan. Um, basically what I'm going to do is have a look to see if there's maybe something else I can make which will increase my survivability. So maybe we'll be checking out the armour. See if that makes a difference. Anyway, wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep every last one of you safe. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.